My name is Lacey Montano, and I compete in the women's 800 meters. And I'm Lashenda Demis, and I'm a 400 meter hurdler. Cool. So tell us a little bit about your training process and how you got ready for the Olympics. All right. So for a lot of the public, the Olympics is every four years, but for us, it's every single day. It's every minute, every single day. So it's been a four-year cycle. Um, you know, you, you show up to, to one Olympic Games or one Olympic cycle, and the next one starts immediately after that. So um, I've been able, I've been fortunate enough to make all the world championship teams leading up to this and have had the international experience. So I think that's the biggest practice, just having experience behind you. Well, actually, last year we came off of world championships, which I won and uh, got my first gold. And uh, this year was the same exact thing that you would do in preparation for any big major championship. So um, it's no different. The stage is the only different thing. Now, in your situation, your mother is your coach. How is it, you know, having your mom as a coach, but then also just having your mom as just a mom? Uh, my mom bought me into the track game, you know, she's, uh, she was running track and then I kind of followed suit and so she was my actual first coach that I had and experienced. So it's kind of normal to me to have her coaching me and I know that she knows her stuff and under her I've ran my best, you know, every other coach hasn't got me to where she has so it's easy for me and I know how to separate the two. What's your inspiration? Um, you know, for me it's this unsaid dream, it's this unsaid passion that, you know, is this, this little spark that's been ignited in you from, I, for me, this since the time I, I walked up out of the womb. Um, I, I don't really have a set moment where I felt like track and field, this is what I want to do. It's just something that has always been inside of me. I've been talking about it since I was a little kid, you know, being like, I want to be in the Olympics. I want to run uh, just as fast as those women do. I want to win a gold medal. And um, I think what separates us from the rest is just the desire to move forward in that direction and chasing a dream and not just having a dream be um, something that you're saying it's being it's something that you're making a reality so who is the artist that you listen to to get pumped up for a competition right now I'm on Kendrick Lamar I tell everybody that's my cousin we're not cousins but we can be I'll let you in but yeah I'm, I'm a Kendrick Lamar fan now and of course Nas and um, 2 Chains. I think uh, for a lot of people, including myself, it's a Wheezy F Baby. Um, you know, there's also, I got Drake in there. You know, I have, I, I got Drake, I got Childish Gambino in my mix.